Howdy guys, welcome back to Super Mario Maker 2. Oh my god, I don't have my mic in the right place. I don't think it really matters that much, but let me just move it there. So, from Jankery123, we have Upside Dizzy Cave. I have been wondering when I was going to see another one of these. Because we saw that one section in the... What video was that? I don't even remember, but there was like, I went in a pipe and it was an upside down cave, and I'm like, oh god. Okay, I thought that was going to change the gravity, but uh... Alright, so I see I can't get up there. I can barely hit that. I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to hit that. Well, let's see what happens. Oh, this is cool, though. Oh, wow. It's like the same level, but now it's, uh, different. Oh, so right still goes right. These blocks here are, aren't going to be there if I hit the switch, though. Okay. <laughs> I'm not sure why I didn't catch on to that. Okay, so apparently that needs to be off to get in that door. That probably dumps you off if you screw something up. Um, we'll try this then. Hmm. Oh, I guess the door will be on this side. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so far so good. This is interesting. My gosh, dude. Hey, checkpoint. Alright. That was easy enough. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, I see more stuff over there, though. <laughs> oh, no. Whoa. Oh, God. Upside down note blocks? Seriously? Oh, my God. Okay, I'm scared, though. I fell into an upside down pit. I sure did. Alright, one more time. From the top. Or is that from the bottom? <laughs> I don't know anymore. I don't know who you are anymore. Okay, alright, um, I don't even dare go for that coin. Let's see here. Oh, I guess I could go for it now. Ooh, is there, uh, is there a reason to do that? I feel like I might need to. No, hit the... Thank you. Why'd you do that? I'm not sure, actually. I'm really not. Huh. Okay, so if I turn these off, that opens the blocks over there. Oh, but then I could probably just go back to the other side and walk across. That is so cool! Oh, that's really good. This is, oh man, this might be my favorite level I've played yet. This is just so resourceful with the... with combining, like, different mechanics and making it work. Uh-oh, now we're on this side. Can go up there. It's very easy to tell what you actually have to do, which is cool. Well, let's see now. Looks like we need to get on the other side and hit the switch, and then maybe uh, have a conveyor belt to go the other way. So you can't go in that door. <laughs> so probably have to go through the pipe then. What does that do for us, though? That brings us back to that door there. Wait, I, <laughs> I keep pressing the wrong button here. I don't know, something come out of this pipe, I wonder. Oh, not really. Okay. All right. Let me let me take a look at this for a second. Okay. I see that they're like we probably need the P switch to um. Oh, okay. There we go. Yeah, need the P switch to activate this door. But we need to take it through the pipe, actually. So let's just do that. It's actually very simple. Boop. There we go. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Cheese strats? No, 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 not really. Um, something tells me I just need to go upside down and hit it. Easy enough. Ooh, there's another piece of here, though. Mayhaps we should take it with us. Oh, man, I've never had to do this before. Uh, <laughs> that was quite awkward, I must say. Alright, so... Oh, that freezes the conveyor belts, but to what end? Oh god, um, maybe we want to wait so we can, oh, but what's all this in here though? Do I need to hit the on-off switch again maybe? Oh, I feel like maybe I want to, but if I do that I'm going to be stuck on this side. I would need something to hit it from below, possibly. Maybe if I go get another piece of switch, would there be another one and then I could just throw it up and hit the switch? Otherwise, I think maybe these are just so I can run under the thwomps over here. It looked like there was a lot to do in there, though. Oh my god, I don't want to leave this level. This is so cool. 
Well, you're not getting back, I can tell you that. <laughs> oh, man. That was really cool. Oh, gosh, dude. What's the world record on that, I wonder? Definitely an I like it for that one. Oh, I'm the only comment? Well, I'll definitely give this level some love because I was impressed. From JamieT36. Oh my gosh, oh, I had my heart skipped a beat for a second there. I'm sorry. I still can't see the name without thinking of you know who. And that kind of looks like her, the mediums. Jeez, but then I thought, well, 36, that's probably your age, but she would only be one year younger than me, so that wouldn't work. Also, zero clears. Um, alright, how many people have tried this, though? 184, yikes. Well, people get confused, though, just like they did in the first game, and they say that's 80, 184 people. That's not, that's 184 attempts. So it could have been, like, two or three people that gave it that many tries, I don't know. I got a bad feeling, though. Oh, there's lava rising. Oh, you know what? Well, at least, uh, at least it stopped before it got up to me. Man, oh man, this is like some Celeste crap or something. By crap, I mean good. Oh god, upside down again. Um, oh dear, I'm gonna have to find the key. Oh god, wow, okay. This boom boom looks so weird. But it's like, you can't help but wonder what would boom booms look like had they been in Super Mario World. And there you go. Okay, there's one key right there. Also 30 coins, because why not? That's a little tough, but you were nice enough to give us a fire flower, so I can't complain too much here. Oof. God, these upside down things that you make me semi-uncomfortable, but could be worse. Um, I don't think I've seen, like, a makeshift boss yet here. This might be the first. Might be a first for me personally. Oh, I thought I was going to make that. Shoot. Oh, well. I don't know how many bosses I'm looking at fighting here, though. It looks like three keys, though. So, maybe it's not too bad. Oh, you need to speed run this. So now I've got to speed eat that shit. Speed eat that shit. Speed eat that shit. Also, dry bones stay alive forever. Oh, I just have to go back, don't I? That's all there really is to it. Alright. This isn't so bad. I say that now, but I haven't seen the Bowser fight yet. If it's like another cat Meowser or something, we could be in trouble here. Get back to where you once belong! Oh, alright, let's see what's in the third pipe. Probably the third key, if I had to guess. Oh, dear. Well, the... Okay. I should be able to. Oh, jeez. Wait, wait. Getcha. Okay, gotcha. I mean, I'd really love a fire flower right about now. Wait, so do I jump out the top, or do I go under the bottom here? Or neither. Wait, can I, like... Ah, oh, that's it, yep. That's not so bad, okay. It's hard to say, like, which one of those is the hardest. They're all kind of different. Which is interesting. Can I take this down a pipe? I'm guessing I can't. Okay, well, we got one key. Um... Which one do I want to do next? Probably this one. This one had the fire flower in it. Yeah, it did. Okay. Oh, man. Those boo-boos are, like, in really harsh places. Right, let's take the key and get back out. Grab the coins, because why not? Alright, uh, let me check something. Will the Fire Flower respawn? Probably not. No, it won't, but he will. I'll just sneak in behind you there, if you don't mind. <laughs> oh, but now I'm smooth, so that's bad. But we have to try. We were smooth, but we're still alive, and that's the important thing. Okay. Oh, man, this hammer bro was in a bad spot, though. Chain chomps, I forgot how nasty you could be. I think that only works with... <gasps> Hello, look what I found. 
Uh, <laughs> I had a feeling there was something like that in here. How did I know? Sneaky, sneaky. That takes care of the hammer bro issue. Pretty much gets us safely out. Okay. <laughs> I love it though. Like, some might say that's like a dev trap a little bit, but... That's how the original Mario was. You know, there were times when there were like hidden power-ups like that, and they just helped you in the level to get past the enemies. You know, because that's how it works. It wasn't about making some crazy Kaizo trap or some P-Switch or whatever. I mean, P-Switches are fine, but... Oh, shoot. Balls that up a little bit there. Oh, that's gonna help a lot. Alright, so now you guys know the secret, and you can go finish the level, too, and be one of very few people who did it. Assuming that the majority of people who try that level don't find that fire flower. <laughs> oh, that still leaves the boom boom, though. Unless there's, like, a star in that room, then maybe. Oh, there's another one-up. <laughs> okay, actually, now that I think about it, I have an idea with this boom boom here. If you can get in here with a mushroom, you could actually just jump over the fire flower get the first hit, run back and get the fire flower before the lava comes up. There you go, now you got two hits in and three. Boom! How's that for strategy? Damn! That was pretty good, actually. <laughs> and now we have the final key. And we're fiery, although that kind of doesn't matter because you get a free fire flower in here anyway. But that's okay. Next time, let's not get hit by the ba -bomb. Also, maybe if I leave that there, I can go back down and get it, but then Bowser would probably refill on health. Oh, how close can he get? I'm going for it. I don't care. Yeah! And last second bomb kill. That's okay, man. We did it. First to do it. Mm -mm. I feel kind of good about that. <laughs> That was actually really good. There were parts of that that I felt like might have been a little too hard at first, but like any Mario game, you know, sometimes you just have to practice a little bit, and I gotta say, I liked that one. Okay, I guess I got a little carried away with that one, but, uh, eh, there it is. <laughs> so this one was also sent to me by JamieT36, but it's a level that she found, not one that she made. So I'm like, okay, you know what? That counts too. You can do that too. This one has a much higher, higher clear rate than her level did, so maybe we'll have an easier time with this one, I don't know. Oh, use the icicle to turn the switch, that's nice. Whoa, uh... Okay, I'm just gonna keep going. Um... Oh, now I can't hit those ones, so I have to... Okay, so jump over this one, jump over this one. So you can't hit any of them. I get it. Oh, that's cool. That's kind of clever. <laughs> oh, man, lucky thing I got some protection, but I probably shouldn't have hit that switch, though. Yeah, I didn't think so. ba 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 do 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 Sitting on the... Huh? Oh, again, because the... Oh. Oh, man. Okay, how are we gonna... Oh, yeah, I guess you just have to stand over them to protect them, like this. Like that. And that. And that. There we go. That was pretty clever, I gotta say. Oh, no. Why do I get the feeling I need to hit this, but then be over here after I hit it? It doesn't look like I'll be able to get back once I jump anyway, though, so maybe not. Nope, no, we're okay. Paying the price now for our insolence. Oh wait, what? Something hit it. Is something up there. Oh, it's the icicle. Okay. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear. This. I see a door. I see a door. Oh, okay. I'm gonna take the door. Just on the off chance that maybe. Oh, I see. It takes you back. So you gotta do this right the first time, then, huh? Ooh, something's hitting the switch up there. It's 
Probably more icicles, if I had to guess. If I hit it and run, I'm not gonna get there in time. But what if... Okay, I can totally get in time. <laughs> I think I might have cheesed that a little bit, I'm not sure. Oh, uh, okay, so, oh man. I don't wanna lose that. Okay, I already see what I have to do here. I have to jump on these so I don't trigger the... Oh, shit, 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 shit. I need to go back. I need this to be on. And ride the spinies so that I don't trigger the icicles, which would in turn trigger the switch. There you go. Oh my god. This is really clever. Oh, I already see what I have to do here, too. It's making a lot of sense now. So you kind of have to pace yourself a little bit. Oh, I want the first one. Well, they won't fall until you get under them, right? Okay, then you just have to go slow. Nope! Not like that. More like this. I think we're okay there. <laughs> oh man, I thought that was gonna take me to the other blue pipe. No, but wait, there's more. There are also two doors here. Mm. Oh, and they go to each other. Okay. Oh, it's probably to reset the room, isn't it? Guess you probably need to do that. So we need to keep these from hitting it. Okay. Yeah, that's not so bad. Oh man, I thought that last one was about to get through there. Ah, no! Oh, well, uh, yes, please. Huh. Okay, and let me just look at this for a second. So, when I hit the switch, the bomb's gonna go over there. What is he gonna do exactly? Is he triggering the icicle? I think that's what the idea is here. Oh, oh I see. That'll light him up. Uh, well, the timing could not be worse for that right now. <laughs> Oh, close. Get over there, get your butt lit. And once he gets lit, well, then his explosion will... Oh, thank God. Okay, um, oh dear. Okay, um... Oh my God! <laughs> Scared the crap out of me here. Oh my God, I've never been so relieved to see the end of a level. <laughs> oh God. I was worried I was gonna have to do all that over again. That was really cool! Oh my gosh, dude. Amazon! I don't know what that Yoshi is anymore. He just keeps evolving and it's getting scary. It's getting scary, y'all.